Bonjour Year 8. I hope that your live lesson went well with your teacher and my classes. I was so pleased to see you. Um, it's really good to um, see you face to face again after a short period of time. Anyway, today, um, for the remainder of the lesson, the last 15 to 20 minutes or so, I just want to do one final um, lesson on clothes, giving opinions, which are a bit more complex now, and describing patterns as well on clothes. And for the rest of the lesson, you're just going to need your exercise book and a pen and a ruler. Thank you for uploading all your work to class charts um, previously. Please remember, upload pictures of all of your work, um, all of the pages in your book, any additional activities you do on Quizlet, snapshots as well from your, um, from your phones or devices. Please just stick to the time given to you on each of the slides. Don't go over this so that you can complete all the activities. If you do have any questions, please email me on the email address showing on the screen. Merci. Okay, year eight, let's print, learn to pronounce these new pieces of vocabulary today. So you'll see we have a question. Que penses-tu de ces vêtements? What do you think of these clothes? So I want you to listen and repeat. Écoutez et répétez. Que penses-tu de ces vêtements? I'll say it one more time. Que penses-tu de ces vêtements? Your turn. Good. And in reply, we're using the opinion phrase to say what we think about the clothes. Écoutez et répétez. Je pense que. Je pense que. Franchement. Franchement. À mon avis. À mon avis. OK. Then we've got new today after saying this and the clothing type or footwear type. We're going to describe the patterns or the material that the clothes are made out of. Écoutez et répétez. A rayure. One more time. A rayure. Good. À poids. À poids. You'll notice that OI makes a wa sound in French. À poids. Okay, repeat after me. À carreau. À carreau. Good. Fleuri. Fleuri. Flowery. So fleuri is the only one where you have to make it match the um, gender and number of the noun. So if it's feminine, we add an extra E. So if it was set jupe fleuri, we would add the E. Uh, for uh, flowery jeans, we'd say se jean fleuri, ending in the I. To use the feminine plural to say these flowery socks, we'd say se chaussettes fleuri, adding the E and the S. Okay, good. Let's pronounce the next one. Écoutez et répétez. En cuir. En cuir. Good. Now the AI in len is like an E sound. Écoutez et répétez. En len. En len. Good. Écoutez et répétez. En coton. En coton. Good. And then to say denim, we use the word for jeans. It's pronounced exactly the same. Écoutez et répétez en jean. En jean. Good. Okay, let's just do two phrases from start to finish. And you'll repeat them after me. I'll do a whole phrase. Je pense que ce jean a rayure et démodé. Your turn. Très bien. Franchement, cette eau fleurie est cool. Your turn. 
en chemin. Good. One more. À mon avis, ces chaussettes en laine sont démodées. Good job, year eight. Très bien. And now I'm going to do faulty echo. So I'm going to correctly say a phrase the first time. The second time I'm going to say one of the words from the boxes or the expressions incorrectly. You only need to write down the word or words that I say incorrectly. So it's only going to be one phrase itself. Okay. In this case, all of them are one word. Okay, there's going to be five of them, so you can write one to five in your margin. Pause if you need to. Okay, here we go. So I'll say it correctly first, incorrectly second time. Je pense que ce maillot de foot à carreaux est cool. Je pense que ce maillot de foot à carreaux Et cool. Pause if you need to. Deux. Franchement, cette chemise en laine est moche. Deux. Franchement, cette chemise en laine est moche. Pause. Trois. À mon avis, ce suite fleuri est joli. Trois. À mon avis, ce suite fleuri est joli. Quatre. Franchement, ces chaussettes à rayures sont démodées. Franchement, ces chaussettes à rayures sont démodées. Pause. 5. Je pense que cette veste à poids est nulle. 5. Je pense que cette veste à poids est nulle. Pause. Rewind if you need to, for any of the bits you didn't quite catch. And then when you're ready for the answers, press play again. Okay, time to check your answers, year eight. So the first one was carro, and I pronounced the X at the end. That's why it sounded weird the second time, carro, x. You don't pronounce an X at the end, you just pronounce the vowel sounds. So that is carro. Écoutez et répétez carro. Carreau. Good. De. You should have written len. Now an AI sound is like an E sound. Okay. Écoutez et répétez len. Len. And I said lane. Like it was an English word, lane. But the AI here makes an E sound, so it's len. Good. Trois. Avis. Do not pronounce the S at the end. It's not avis, it's à mon avis. Quatre. Franchement. CH makes a sh sound. Sh, not ch. I think I said franchement. Franchement. Okay. So an, an A N in French is an R sound, so franchement. Écoutez et répétez franchement. Franchement. Good. And cinq. Écoutez et répétez poids. Poids. It's not poise. It's poids, an O-I sound in French makes a wa sound. You don't pronounce the S, it's poids. Good, well done, year eight. Okay, year eight, I'm going to read um, five sentences uh, using the sentence builder grid. I just want you to write the French that you hear me say. Pens at the ready, off we go. I'll say each one twice. Ah. Je pense que... 
Je pense que ce jogging à poids, ce jogging à poids est joli, est joli. Je pense que ce jogging à poids est joli. Pause. Deux. Franchement, franchement, cette eau en cuir, cette eau en cuir est cool. Est cool. Franchement, cette eau en cuir est cool. Pause. 3. À mon avis, à mon avis, cette jupe à rayures, cette jupe à rayures est démodée. Et démodé. À mon avis, cette jupe à rayures est démodée. Pause. 4. Je pense que. Je pense que. Ces baskets en jean. Ces baskets en jean sonnent moches. Sonnent moches. Je pense que ces baskets en jean sonnent moches. Pause. 5. Franchement. Franchement. Cette veste fleurie, cette veste fleurie est nulle, est nulle. Franchement, cette veste fleurie est nulle. Pause if you need to. Rewind if you need to. Make sure you've got five sentences written in French. And now what I'd like you to do is to translate those sentences into English. So pause to do all of that now and press play when you're ready to check your answers. And here's what you should have written. Je pense que ce jogging à poids est joli. I think that this spotty pair of jogging bottoms is pretty. You may find it a bit awkward to make that sound naturally in English because the order is very different. But that's the best I could come up with. Okay, franchement, cette eau en cuir est cool. Frankly, this leather top is cool. Trois, à mon avis, cette jupe à rayures est démodée. In my opinion, this stripy skirt is old-fashioned. Quatre, je pense que ces baskets en jean sont moches. I think that these denim trainers are awful or ugly. And cinq, franchement, Cette veste fleurie est nulle. Okay, frankly, this flowery jacket is rubbish. Now, for the last one, I want you to check that you have fleury matching vest with an E on the end. And that nulle is also the feminine singular version, N-U-L-L-E. Well done, year eight. Well done, Year 8. Thank you for all your hard work in today's lesson. Uh, please take photos of all of your work in your book today. So all of the work that you did on um, feedback, plus the work on the new sentence builders as well. Merci beaucoup. Au revoir.